In the competition's inaugural year, the Gaira Netball Association looks to get more young women involved in the sport and see it grow. Um, Gaira Netball Association, it's the first time um, we've been running on our own for our last oh, donkey years. We've been go going together with the rugby, so it was under Gaira Social and Sports Association. For the first time this year, we've gone on our own, Gaira Netball Association, where it's run by women alone. Okay, our vision is to empower young women and to develop and identify those hidden skills so we can try and push them up into the national and hopefully into the purpose. The association also aims to field teams to compete at the Netball National Championships in September. Selection to the Kairuku, we affiliated to Kairuku Netball Association because currently the federation is going districts. So we affiliated to Kairuku Hiri District. Kairuku Hiri District is affiliated to the federation. So we're going for the championships on 21st to 28th of September and the girls are looking forward to it. The village has seen a lot of interest in the sport with girls as young as 7 and 8 eager to be a part of the competition. The little ones, even we have under sevens and under eights, although they're too young, so we've done a little, little division for under eights where we play, that we get them to play before the under tens, and then we have the tens, 13, and there are teams that are really full. So in some, some uh, clubs, the seven new players go on at halftime, they're off, and the seven new players go back on again. So they want to have chance or give chance to everybody to have a game. So that's the interest. Gaira Netball Association hopes to see more young women get involved in the sport and see the competition grow and become more competitive in the years to come. Dion Kombang, National MTV Sports.